Lurking in the comment section of many videos, such as this one right here, are reply threads so scummy that I think they just take the whole comment bot situation to a new level. And since this is actually a financially related scam, I figured I would take a second to cover it on this channel. Now the whole thing starts off rather inconspicuously with someone just saying, love this video, thanks to you, which, I mean, it's not exactly the most powerful message ever spoken, but not exactly something that you would expect to garner 12 replies when there's only 34 likes on the comment. And this will be important in like literally less than a minute, but the guy who made this video, Spencer Cornelia, actually has in the second paragraph of his description a note saying that he believes almost anyone who is trying to trade cryptocurrencies is actually making less money than he's been able to through real estate. But our girl Janice first gets a reply saying, depending on one stream of income in this pandemic would be the most naive thing to do at the moment which I think would better serve as a statement left as like an original comment on the video itself rather than a reply to a comment like this, but I mean it's fair enough and I'm sure Spencer himself would agree. At the very least in videos where he breaks down his full income, he does have several sources of income himself and he does, you know, obviously support the idea of at least trying to seek out income through real estate because it's something that he heavily promotes on his channels. There are a lot of people that are all about the stock market and there are a lot of people like me who are all about real estate investing. If you watch this channel at all, you're gonna know that I am all in on real estate investing. So you might still be inclined to believe that there's actually nothing to be seen here at all. But the truth is, this comment is really meant to get you thinking that you can't just rely on your job in order to get through the pandemic. And therefore, you should listen to the next people who go on to tell you about this amazing opportunity to trade cryptocurrencies if you just reach out to this one guy on Facebook. The next reply goes on to say, with the recent increase in cryptocurrency, investing now will be a smart decision. And the reason that I pointed out the whole context of this video just a minute ago is because these bots are just that. They are YouTube comment bots. So they're not able to understand that the context of this video is Spencer literally saying that he believes over the next few years through his own investments, he will be able to make more money than most people attempting to trade cryptocurrencies because they are telling you about the fact that you should go on to trade cryptocurrencies to make it through this pandemic. All while starting it off by saying again that they love this video in the first place. And I know Janice is a part of this because she's left other comments on this channel saying how she has actually invested with the person that they're trying to pitch you on and how his trading strategies are working, very awesome, and that she's a living testimony of him as well. But something funny actually happened here where they either messed up their own script or maybe YouTube deleted one of the comments for being spam because after Disney fan talks about how we should be investing in cryptos because of their recent rise, Alan immediately comes in just full of guns a-blazing on us saying, I made profit of $8,000 trading with him last week. Who exactly is him and how in the world did you make $8,000 in one week? Well, then Janice goes on and leaves her comment about how his trading strategies are working, very awesome. I'm sure you did not understand what I just said there, but at least I already read the comment once for you guys and it is on the screen there. And then we immediately get another comment from Joan saying, crypto is the future. This comment that is just absolutely uncomprehensible. I'm assuming that they were trying to actually put the contact info for the Dave person. I think a bunch of comments actually got deleted here and what these comment bots will actually do and Atomic Shrimp shows this in one of his shorts if you want to check that out, but they'll actually continually adding stuff to the comments until it can actually be left and not get deleted by either the creator or by YouTube spam bot filter. And that's why the comment has so many things added besides the numbers because originally it was being read as a phone number and I'm assuming that's actually a WhatsApp contact, which if anyone ever tells you to contact them on WhatsApp, just immediately get out of there. But then they keep on going and finally Camilio actually tells you that the person Dave J is the person that you can actually invest with. Catherine then asks, how can you get his info? Of course, they have to lead you into that. Then someone else says that they're from New Zealand and they sure do need an expert like Dave to invest their coin. How do they reach them? And then finally, this person is able to get the phone number in by adding a ton of stuff to it as well. Once again, trying to avoid that spam bot filter and then finally, we get a comment saying that they got recommended to expert Dave on Twitter and invested, someone asking how good they are, and then 
At the very bottom, William says, when someone is straightforward and good at what he does, people will always speak for them. For me, I would say expert Dave Javins of financial education has always been the best when it comes to binary options and cryptocurrency investing. Trading with him is always a happy ending, which is actually the most intelligible comment by far in this entire thread. One that's almost scarily good at probably convincing a few people to fall for it, but thankfully so many of the comments did get deleted that I think it would be extremely hard for anyone to actually figure out how to contact this guy it doesn't even say to contact him on whatsapp they just left the numbers so if anyone ever does end up going for that phone number well just don't do it because obviously that'd be stupid i mean if you want to go and i guess spam or like you know tie up a spam calls line and actually mess with them in that regard i mean i'm, I'm not going to tell you not to do that i feel like harassing any real human being is always off limits but if we're talking about literal scammers that are trying to steal your money then it gets a little bit different and obviously there's people who make whole careers on youtube just wasting their time in the first place and those guys are pretty awesome so i would never say not to do that i think that would actually be pretty funny but i would just say avoid calling that number because it's not really something you want to get yourself involved with unless you actually know what you're doing yourself. With that all being said though, I just wanted to go over this because common threads like this are actually popping up a lot on YouTube. They're a little bit ridiculous and these bots, they really are trying to convince people that they're having real conversations and actually just naturally leading into talking about some expert who can help them invest their coin. In reality, he's going to steal all of your coin. You will have nothing. So just avoid it if you're a newbie to this because obviously you do not want to be falling for any scams. I mean, that is more than obvious, but beyond that, if you just happen to have any kind of crypto investments, I think you would already be aware of the fact that this is a scam in the first place. So these comments are, as scummy as they are, a little bit hilarious as well because I can't imagine too many people are falling for them. With that all being said though, that is it for this video. I'm actually running a giveaway for some silver, so if you want to get a chance to earn some for free, I will link that in the description. Beyond that though, if you did find yourself enjoying the video, subscribing to the channel and actually sharing it with a friend, leaving a like on the video to help it do better the algorithm. These are all things that will let me know that I should continue to post this type of content for you guys because you guys are enjoying it. I noticed uh, one of the videos I made had like a 2% uh, impression click-through rate, meaning that it got like 1,500 impressions but 50 views from that. Or I'm I'm sorry, I think that would be 2,000. I, I don't know, 2,500 I think actually what it would be. So basically, my point being, I need to do something to get more people who are seeing the videos actually engaged and hopefully this will be the type of video you guys enjoy. But that is truly it for this one now. Peace.